Hey guys, how are you doing? And Apple have surprised us with two software updates for iPhone users. When we were waiting for iOS 16, all of a sudden users have noticed iOS 15.7 update also dropped. It was there in beta testing for quite some time and all of a sudden Apple decided to release it in the same day that iOS 16 drops. I wish they delayed it somehow because it might cause some server related issues. Anyhow, the iOS 15.7 is officially here like if you want to stay in iOS 15 versions if you don't want to jump into the iOS 16 right away if you have any apps compatibility related problems then you can update to the iOS 15.7 it contains only bug fixes and security fixes and there will be no new features added in the iOS 15.7 or any further updates that comes in future like iOS 15.7.1 or 15.7.2 all of those updates will contain important bug fixes and security fixes only. When it comes to iOS 16, it contains plenty of new features as shown in our previous episodes. I'll leave a link to that in the description and in the first to come in some hidden features that iOS 16 brings to your iPhone. And the last iOS 16 RC release candidate version also very stable when it comes to user feedback. So I think if you're ready to update your iPhone to the iOS 16, you can do it right away. The server load might be high. So give some time if you're seeing any issues or slow speed issues as suggested in our last episode and then try updating it after a few hours and of course you can straight away update to the iOS 16 you don't have to update to 15.7 in order to update to 16 version so both are entirely different versions and you can decide to update which one you want in your iPhone right now thank you for watching and if you find this video useful don't forget to share it with your friends thank you and have a wonderful day